What's up, guys? It's Dr. Gazoo here, and I am here uh, with Swap Panda again. Say hello, Swap Panda. Hello, sirs. <laughs> hello. Uh, anyways, um, so I'm maybe that might be watching. Ladies and gentlemen. Anyways, so here is gameplay um, of my Osprey Gunner. Um, this is old gameplay. You know, this is when I was getting fourth prestige. This is old. Um, so <coughs> anyway, so. The gun that I use in this gameplay is the MK14, and the main thing that I want to talk about about the MK14 in any semi-automatic is trigger finger. Okay, um, so D'Anthony and I have ridiculous trigger fingers that we get reported all the time for mod controllers. Yeah. Um, so <laughs> I'll, I'll put some gameplay footage up at the end of this of our trigger fingers just in a private match. Um. Yeah, I remember our uh, funny video that we only posted on Facebook. Oh, Mud. Yeah. Anyways, so um, yeah, so I'll I'll get my trigger finger in a private match and his trigger finger in a private match. And um, anyways, so this gameplay I do start off using a an L L one eighteen or whatever it's called. And I do admit it, I was using FMG nines because this is before. I really got pissed off at him, so I started using them. Um. Anyways, so there's a couple talks I like to talk about. Is guns that I'd like to get golden, guns that I like to pick up off the ground that aren't mine, and like why I like picking up other people's guns up, and trigger finger. Um. So first, it's gonna be trigger finger. Anyways, so D'Anthony and I have ridiculous trigger fingers, as I said, and um. So, it, when I start using the MK14, you could tell, you know, there's like no recoil and sometimes skips the noise, uh, sound effects and stuff. You know, that just, just shows how fast it is. Um, no, I swear, I, I do not have a modded controller. I will make gameplay footage of, with my, you know, like, it, with a vision of my remote, I mean, of my controller. But, um, just to prove it, if you still don't believe me. But, um, you know, I, I don't cheat. I, do not, I discourage it a lot. Um, cheating is just no fun because it takes no skill to cheat because the cheat's doing everything for you. Do you have anything you'd like to say, Dancer? See right there. Well, when it comes to, when, when, when it comes to uh, cheating, stuttered pretty hard there. But um, when it comes to cheating, sometimes you have to actually, well, now that I'm thinking about it, this is an online game. Well, I mean, I, I understand how modded controllers, they don't do the work literally for you. But certain cheats do. Um, that's what I meant. But modded controllers do all the triggering, all the pushing and stuff for you, which is re a tod a ted Um, I hate it. When the way I was thinking, I was thinking on um, certain games that don't have... Uh, well, online access, I guess I could say. Like, COD 4 uh, campaign. That had cheats, but you earned them. Well, yeah, now, that's one thing. Um, I don't mind modders at all if they're doing it offline and not interrupting anyone else's, you know, game. Because, you know, Call of Duty is made for fun. And, um, you know... Like all video games. Yeah. Who would want someone to modify the game to give them an, an advantage and make the game not fun? Um, which is, I don't mind people that mod it offline because it doesn't affect me with the crowd. Um, so, you know, things like that don't affect me, I don't mind. But, um, trigger finger. Uh, so, people make a huge, you know, big deal over a trigger finger. It's just a trigger finger. It's easy as hell to do. And, it's not like you could even prove that they're using a mod controller in the first place. Now, certain controllers, you can tell that it's a mod controller if it shoots way too fast, like physically impossible to. Wait, let's go to Modern Warfare 2 for a minute. Oh, God. FAL. Oh, God. That was the most modded controller ever. Now, this guy, I don't know how he didn't see me, but, um, yeah, the FAL. Like the puke of that gun. It's a good gun, but I, I just can't stand the modders. Um, modders kind of ruined it. Yeah. 
Modern Warfare 2 is just ridiculous. Easy. I was just playing the other day. You know, first game I got on, I'm only like level 30 first prestige because I prestige for the prestige token. I get, I did get it. Um, anyways, so I prestige for the token, and um, what happened is, uh, <laughs> oh my god, I just lost my train of thought. Uh, anyways. Oh yeah, prestige. So I all I have is like you know, low attachment guns. You know, guns that don't have many attachments and not a big variety of guns. So I was using like I think it was the only three five. First thing I do, I go fifteen and zero on a search and destroy map. First game I got back from my own for two. I, I half the maps were so different, like from what I remember. Now that part, that was funny. I don't know how I did that. I just turned instantly. Um, anyway, so Danthony, he's not, he's back in North Carolina, um, sad, but he's coming back up, he's getting his little license there, Eventually. drive a car, um, so that's why we're doing this over Xbox again, the commentary, oh, something happened, um, anyways, I so Anthony, do you have any, <laughs> do you have anything to, uh, start talking about? Three yeah, minutes. I'm finishing driver's ed class uh, tomorrow. Yeah. And then I have to wait for my teacher to call me so then I can do the driving part. <laughs> and I, um. D'Anthony with the license. I know I'm telling people that all their business, but, uh. D'Anthony with the license is scary, guys. Okay, I, I don't trust them. <laughs> He'll be driving. Oh hey, we're actually I can't get my license till junior year. Oh that's right, yeah. But it's gonna be funny. Year to go. So when um, when since when you have a permit, you could drive with a parent or guardian in the car, um, or you know instructor obviously. Um, or someone with the license over five years. Yeah, over five years. And well, at least well, Anthony's only my age. He's fourteen. So, but since North right. Carolina <laughs> is different laws. It, you know, it changed everything. Um, anyway, so I was about one kill away from an MOAB and I died. But, uh, I choked. Yeah, I choked. I choked. Right here, I choked. I, I get this cred in. I get that kill. Oh, no, I don't get the kill. That's right. And I, I'm like, whoa, that guy's right there. I'm going to go kill him. And then he's using a striker around the corner. And shoots me in the base. Actually, yeah, he is using right here. Anyways, um, this the gameplay is almost over. Um, people are leaving the party because I'm not talking. It's fun. Um, neither one. So here's a quick tip. Um, I like to do two v twos and face off. Face off is my favorite place, and I do give these guys thumbs up. You know, tip to my hat because they did not leave. I went like m my friend Stud Poner went like. 37 and 2, and I went like 47 and 5, and That's these guys, so confirmed. and these, yeah, it's so confirmed, and these guys did not leave until there was 10 seconds left. I, I, I was so happy with them, I, or like a minute left, I can't read that on this small screen, you know, I was, I was <laughs> proud, no, I'm joking, I'm not proud, but, you know. Leave. Yeah, I'm. Just, I was happy, but yeah, kill confirmed. If you play face off with kill confirmed and you have you and your buddy there, just don't collect tags. Don't don't even. I don't even collect tags even when I'm playing legit. I I do somewhat, but a lot of times I don't. Anyways, I have five seconds here left to record, so I'll see you guys later. Say bye, Anthony. Yeah. So let's see, D'Anthony. So what like. What is your specialty on Call of Duty?